guys so I am back with another video today this is a hair tutorial today I'm so excited I haven't done a hair tutorial video in such a long time like a long time so I wanted to go ahead and film this for you guys I haven't um, filmed a video on how I style my short hair since I cut it which has been um, like two or three months now so um, I thought what a better time than now to film how I style my short hair because um, short hair is super trendy right now it is like what everybody is like obsessed with is a short choppy like beachy hair um, I personally love it um, I cut mine for a um, reason of I just wanted to cut off all my dead hair and kind of start over with growing out my healthy hair this is super easy you guys I mean it takes like no time at all so I really hope that you guys enjoy this video and I will see you in my next one bye Mwah. I am going to begin with freshly washed hair um, and all I did was blow dry it. The reason that I mentioned that it's freshly washed is because I don't always wash my hair every day. Um, I have super dry hair so I wash it every two days. Sometimes I can get away with three days um, if I like put it up in a bun or use dry shampoo or something like that. Um, but this is freshly washed hair. Um, I do feel like if you have second day hair or third day hair, this hairstyle is going to work better for you because um, dirty hair holds better. But we're just going to fill up my hair with a ton of hairspray so it'll hold. So first I'm going to mention um, the things that I put in my hair after I get out of the shower, after I wash it. All I used was uh, the Matrix Biolage Daily Leave-In Tonic. It's it just instantly moisturizes. The reason I picked this up is because I saw Casey Holmes um, mention it in one of her favorites videos or a hair care video or something of the sort. But she talked about this and her. if you watch her channel, her hair is so gorgeous. It's long and healthy and beautiful. She, it's like amazing. So um, I was like, I'm going to give this a try because I love leave-in conditioners. And like I mentioned, my hair is really dry, so I do need one. And then I add, after I put the, after I spray that all over my hair, I add the Paul Mitchell um, Super Skinny Smoothing Serum. One pump and I, and I distribute it between my hands and then I run it along my ends. And when I blow dried it, all I used, sorry... It's gross, I'm full of hair. Um, all I used is this ceramic round brush. Looks like this. And I just used this blow dryer that I've had forever. This is the plugged in um, blow dryer. It's um, so cute, right? Like hot pink, it's like so pretty. Zero, one, and two heat setting. And I just put it on the middle one, the one, so it's not uh, super hot on my hair. Um, the curling wand that I'm going to use is the Numi 3-in-1 um, curling wand. So it comes with three different barrels, and the one that I'm using is the second to the smallest one, so this is the middle one. Um, I just feel like it gives me um, that beachy wave, especially with the length of my hair. And the heat setting that I have it on is, all, is, is at the highest one, all the way to 200. What my hair girl did was she cut it shorter from the inside. Of my hair and the bottom she then left the rest like the top half longer just so the short could give it like extra volume and it could look extra big um, and super full and she did cut it shorter from the back and longer towards the front but if I missed anything and I didn't answer one of your questions um, just please go ahead and comment it down below I tried to cover as much as I thought as much as I possibly thought I could so let's begin so first thing I'm going to do is brush through it. I'm just using a wide tooth comb. You want to make sure you don't have any tangles. And then I'm going to part it like right above my ears. It's like halfway. And I'm going to take one of these butterfly clips and clip it upwards. Then I'm going to split the um, bottom half of my hair in half. All I'm going to do is literally, you guys, this is going to be so fast. You're going to love this. So I'm going to take a piece of my hair. 
my, I'm going to take my wand, I'm going to put it behind my head, and I'm going to wrap going in an outwards motion, so outwards away from my face, and I'm literally going to hold it for like 2.5 seconds, like not any longer than that. And if some pieces fall out, that's totally fine. There you go. Like that's literally all I held it for. I don't know if you guys could see that. I will show you guys a couple pieces. Um, since my hair is so like choppy, um, if some of you know the pieces fall out, it's it's no big deal. This look is supposed to be you know messy and beachy, and I always hold um, the little end of the hair like this. Like I don't let it touch the the wand because I want it to kind of end straight like this. So that gives it more of a beachy look. So it's pretty much it for this side. So now that the I'm done with the bottom half, I'm going to take my hairspray. I use the L'Oreal Paris El Net Latin for color treated hair, even though, because it has a UV filter, even though I don't have color treated hair right now, but my boyfriend just picked up the first one he saw. So what happens when you send your man on store runs. It's okay though. So pick up pieces and spray. And I really love this hairspray because it gives such a such body and you can literally brush your hair out. Um, if you don't wash your hair every day, you can brush the hairspray out of your hair and it'll just like disappear. For Since you guys know that, since I mentioned that I don't wash my hair every day. This is an amazing hairspray. I'm literally going to do the same thing, you guys. Now, so for this part, you can obviously part your hair whichever way you like it. I find that when I do this, I feel like I have a lot more volume. Um, because there's more hair on this side and I can tease it. You can do it either way. I don't like doing this side because I have a cow's lick right here. So it just, I feel like, makes it look more obvious. But I think for this hairstyle, um, Kim Kardashian has been, like, parting it to the side. But I ain't about that life, alright? I'm going to do it the way I want to do it. Then the middle. And I'm going to clip one half away. I just like to kind of mess up this front part like the crown so it's not so like perfect and glued to my head separate any curls that might have like gone together back super PC and messy so if you're thinking about cutting your hair I was super scared to do it because I know it takes forever to grow for some of you girls but you know what just do it like hair is hair and it grows back and you know what if you miss your long hair then you can always buy extensions you know um, and you can have the best of both worlds so but I say you know what you have one life to live cut that hair girl cut it so I really hope you guys enjoyed this um, short hair tutorial and that's pretty much all I have to say. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye. <laughs> so the reason I picked this up actually was because I saw Casey Holmes mess message it. Why can't I speak? <sighs> so wrap it. That was a fail. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. Are you recording? Oh my gosh. Sorry, I told you.
totally forgot to take my gum out of my mouth. It's like so annoying.